Hi, Nick here. Today I'm going to show you how you can sync outline with OneNote. Let's get started. The first thing that you need to do is you go to the top right, select outline, then preferences, then you'll get this window over here. Once you click sync, you'll be able to find OneDrive over here and you can log in right there. Then press sign in and that's it, you're signed in. But you can see that there's no notebooks reflecting here and if you close this out, nothing has been added. You go to where it says notebooks over here, there's a little plus sign, press on the plus sign, scroll down till you see open from OneDrive and here you can find a book, double click on it. Everything should be imported. Now that we've got the notebooks imported, you're gonna see that we have here one, two, three folders correlating to one, two, and three folders here in outline. So where are these folders? If you go to your finder, you select your computer. From there, you hit on your users. From users, you select your own user and you'll see OneDrive. This, if you have it installed, but this does not contain your files. In fact, you have to press Command, Shift and Dot to reveal hidden files, go into Library, then select Outline and then a Storage 1 and that is where your notebooks are located. If we go back to Outlines Preferences and on the Sync tab, we look at OneDrive, you're going to see that I have my notebook added here. I had not had any success in syncing between any other files because it says to sync with iCloud. Just make sure to put your notebooks to the Outline folder in iCloud. After doing so, nothing changes. In fact, let's entertain this option by go to iCloud in Finder. I put one file over here, which I'm not able to select. If I press Open, it says that it is not a notebook. The only one thing that you can do with iCloud is if you go to backup, you can select here the iCloud folder and set backup now. You can press show backup files in order to get to the actual folder. But if you click on the outline folder inside of your iCloud drive, you'll see that there is nothing here. But if you press command shift and dot in order to reveal hidden files, you'll see a dot backups file where all the backup files are indeed located. Overall, I would say the import method and syncing of Outline is very poorly done and I'm still not sure exactly 100% how it does, but if this video helped you, don't forget to leave a like.